the state of Virginia has an impressive wine industry, with vineyards dotting the landscapes in Northern Virginia. We've added an unusual family-owned winery to our schedule, Old House Vineyards in Culpeper, which has been transformed from an old alfalfa farm to a popular destination for award-winning wines and much more. We're making 10 different wines right now. So what we've got out here in the vineyard is Chardonnay, Petit Verdot, Tanat, Vidal Blanc, Cabernet Franc, Chamberson. It's vines as far as I can see. Okay. <laughs> and it's not just a variety of wines. Old House has been called a triple threat as a winery, distillery, and brewery. Pat Kearney and I try some of his favorites in their World War II themed tasting room. So the rows of wine that we were walking down, these two bottles were made from those particular grapes. And so the Clover Hill is a dry style Vidal. So this is almost like a Pinot Gris. It's crisp, very floral also. So. Cheers. Cheers. I like that, it's really light. It does remind me of floral, summer. I think it would be really good with a seafood pasta. It would be very good with a seafood pasta. Very nice. And I usually do not chase my glass of wine with vodka, but you know, I'll make an exception here at Old House, so. <laughs> so, so on the vodka, it's called Dude Spirit, and it actually goes with the theme of the tasting room. So in honor of World War II vets, which we have a lot of here in Culpeper. Cheers. Cheers. I don't normally drink straight vodka, but it's pretty good. Thank you. It's got a little bit more uh, sweetness and nuttiness than you'll typically find with a, a regular vodka. Cheers. Cheers. Now what to try next? There's plenty on tap at Old House Vineyards. <laughs>